What is so ancient only an internet veteran can remember? Pictures loading one line at a time. Having a stack of magazines or something else by the computer to distract yourself while a web page loads. Chat rooms that were filled with people instead of porn bots. Signing up for a new email address and the username not already being taken. Glorious times. Personal web pages. With counters. Open mouth smile. The sound of a dial-up modem does when connecting to the internet you young punks. ICQ. Winamp skins. CDs to access internet. And the best of the best. The glorious 56k modem dialing sound. I remember when you couldn't use the computer and be on the phone at the same time unless you had two separate phone lines. And you had to dial into the internet. The provider gave out a list of numbers in case one was busy. Ask Jeeves, Internet Butler. Hamster Dance and the Blender Frog. A slash S slash L. Encarta Encyclopedia. Having to download a song overnight on dial up through some shady torrent site. And the next morning was like playing Russian roulette, finding out if you downloaded a song or a virus. Netscape Navigator. Napster. Amazon.com being a bookstore. Using MapQuest to download turn-by-turn -turn directions for vacation and it being a massive stack of papers sometimes. Killed the toner one time in the printer had to go get more before we could get the last few pages. The Herald of the Death of Information. The Dancing Baby. Where's? Google had no ads. And bragged about it. Yada. That is a sweet earth. Round. And we. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.